Okay, so I just wanted to show you real quick a uh, basic way that you can use a scorcher. I know a lot of people have this question, and I did too before I started trying to use it, but this is a basic line of sight method that I use. Um, basically, you get into a position that you want far away, behind some cover preferably. Point the gun at your target. Now, right now, I'm pressing F on Tower 3. Over on the right, under Elevation Control, next to REL, you see it says 71.73. When you uh, point the gun at the target and press F, a number will pop up under REL. If you don't see it, keep pressing F. The position I'm at right now is at 71.73, so I'm just going to move here, get behind cover, and then I'm going to set the gun barrel to the position of 71.73. I could have stayed where I was, but I wanted to get behind these bushes for cover. So once I set it up to 71.73, fire a few shots. We'll see where they land. Once you fire your shot, if you open up the map, you can see where your artillery shell is headed. So my target is Tower 3 there. I also set a marker right on Tower 3. It makes it much easier to line up your shot when, when you can't see your target, like right now. Somebody's coming up tower five right now, coming up tower five. And it does the further you are Thank it you. takes a while for the shell to get there. The further you are away from the target. It's a pretty close hit. No, I came up top floor, he's sitting right there on the platform. He came up, he's up. Looks like we got some enemies over in this area. That's basically how you do it with the line of sight. Without the line of sight and without the artillery computer, it's going to be a bit trickier. You need, you need either a lot of guesswork or you're going to have to figure out the uh, math. Now I'm just going to move here just for the hell of it. Be right, right out in the open for everybody to see me. But it's kind of fun and satisfying to see your artillery shells hit. Two off-roads I just blew up. <laughs> 